uh, last time they, when do the knife breathing, the first week teacher teaches ma. Then do all that like, <clears throat> like that, no, like, <clears throat> then after the second she say, hi, you, I observe, ah, you do not wrong, but I think I must remember like a brass. So uh, each time I do, suddenly this brass picture will come out, the fat brass on the kupala, like that. <laughs> Actually, like last time I remember two, three years ago when I hear the word meditation, I, I think also purity also have ever had some meditation. I was like, uh, sometimes when I see those brochures, I was like, ah, meditation, no, you don't know. And then always the logo that teacher Alan will always come out, always he will see like on the, on the watu, you know. So I said, I cannot even see sure jato one, you know. So, so at that time, definitely, uh, maybe also uh, the lifestyle or maybe things uh, are busy. You won't, this thing won't become that you want to put it as part of your menu, part of and parcel of your activities. And now you ask me, I just love yoga. I just love to practice yoga even if I don't have a class I'll do a little bit and this is so unlike me and with meditation also the same it all started with mindfulness I remember my first class of mindfulness and purity had under the regular session I was so scared then teacher said just go I said hi I cannot sit for one hour teacher said no lah not just sit lah got other things so okay I tried then it's like hey not too bad and then I saw you call friends I said hey maybe you can try so we come then eventually I had people a few of my friends who really want to join but too bad then MCO came you know and we cannot then I spoke to you and you always share with me you are like just share and sometimes you know we even end up arguing on some of the concepts what's your bread <laughs> yeah and then you're sharing you're trying to share and say and then I, I couldn't get it but I said never mind maybe I just couldn't get it and perhaps I've given a perception of shutting myself off then and then i remember you always tell me maybe buah belum masa. okay never mind so i said ah oh, okay lah maybe as long as i'm still around one day suddenly the tubuh plang or the flower plang buka i will go so i remember i also asked teacher teacher got uh, got many meditation and, and then i teacher was saying that not so easy to teach you know just kali one day he said he would think about it when he had i told myself i'm just gonna sign up yeah whether i like it or not, i don't know but i thought i would do it so that's how I said. And if you ask me today, no regrets and I glad, I'm glad I did it. Yeah. One thing good is teacher and always relate back to life experience, to his experience and relate. Then from there, I, we look, we look. And then we try to uh, uh, practice. It means we try to practical, you know, what practical. Mm -hmm. Then the past two can you realize that, eh, then when you experience it it no more in the head it becomes yeah. inside inside your blood already i also learned in this course that you can't stop the thoughts but you can acknowledge them don't judge them and let them go and i think uh this gives me even more a clarity on even the perception that i used to have to you know to really not like uh uh, become a, a, a hindrance to things that I want to explore. Sunday, uh, Sunday, I actually did uh, 30 minutes. Uh, I don't want to come out, especially uh, towards the end. I, when I say I don't want to come out, how I do is I'll put alarm, <laughs> I'll put my stopwatch, my timer. Then when my timer rings, I will usually let it ring. Then I will remember all the say, okay, uh, be aware of your surroundings. So I also tell myself, be aware of your surroundings, be aware of your body, take a deep breath and slowly inhale, exhale, you know. So I'll say that after finish, I'm on my alarm. So when that day the alarm rang, I just let it ring, I didn't bother. And then I open my eyes, I just off the alarm and I continue. So I find uh, I'm enjoying that stillness, I mean, that awareness, the calmness. So that's why I think it's something that maybe I've been deprived of because I'm quite uh, everywhere, yeah. So, so at that moment, I just like, hey, it's very nice. So I continue. Uh, and I also like some meditation. So maybe it was the ex first experience when, when teacher introduced to us during the course. Then when there was the, when the sound just ceased, stop, that moment when I actually experienced the stillness of the mind, that was truly amazing. Because content is really uh, is really put 
a lot of thoughts put through. Lah. I can really see that because, and it is also a very a well-balanced course content that emphasizes on theoretical, theoretical, practical, and also the breakout sharing. And I think this is very good. To, too much of theoretical sometimes can be a bit too much of information downloading. So the whole course, I find it was uh, really thought through very nicely done in a way that we have uh, a balance of theory, uh, practical, that means our guided meditation, and at the same time when we share in our group, so that then you start realizing that, hey, uh, my, my, my other students also went through the same, or maybe hey, they got a different experience. So you realize that everyone is different in their experience in this journey. You know something, uh, I I think I ever tell you, I remember you used to tell you long time, you said, hey, you know, I always dream, you know, something scared, something this, you know. Um, I seldom, I dream, I dream also, I seldom, I can not can remember. But I find in this, uh, after the first week, actually, my first week, still nothing like normal, but my second week, until now, uh, nearly, lah, uh, almost every day, I have a, I would dream one. And in fact, um, uh, last week, I actually want, I can dream and I can remember. And you know, one of it is I dream of my late mother. And we can have a conversation. So, and I could remember what she actually tells me to do. And actually her birthday was yesterday. I could remember so clearly. And, and we can go into a conversation. And suddenly my alarm rang. And, and I, I don't know this, I shared with the team that day with the breakout session. Then I say, because I was so aware of what's then, you know, I tido balik, no, you know, I don't sleep much, but this time I can sleep, I can sleep, I can sleep again. <laughs> and then uh, when I sleep, right, I continued my dream. I have benefited uh, and also the experience. Uh, definitely, you know, like back to your question, if you ask me if there's an opportunity, will I? Recommend people to join? Yes, of course. Mm. Hey, anyone, any, anyone, anywhere, anytime, people can meditate. Yes, it must have commitment. Uh, you must have, if I, I think it's a discipline and commitment to allocate some time, but it can be just a good 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes daily. And from there you progress. And I think, it's definitely not something too much to ask for. 